Hello and welcome to a short meditation on strategies for managing your stress in uncertain times. Just bear with me while I get to the screen. And we'll share the screen and here we go. Start from the beginning, so apologies for the clunky start. This is a guided visualisation to reduce your stress response. There's a little bit of housekeeping. It may feel you, may cause you to feel a little drowsy or very relaxed. So a few precautions. Please do not listen to this while you're driving, operating machinery, or you are in a situation that lead, needs your full attention. Please do make sure that you are in a comfortable place where you're not going to be disturbed for around 15 minutes. And by continuing to listen, you imply that, you're, that you've given your consent to accept the suggestions given in this recording. Make sure that your phone is turned off, um, that you're comfortable, you're warm, and no pets around you and no distractions. If you do need to return to um, full awareness, you'll do so quite easily. So take a deep breath in. And as you breathe in, allow your belly to expand and hold for count of four. And as you exhale for the count of four, draw your belly right in. Hold again for four. And I find a four, four count is much easier to remember. If you feel comfortable doing your holds on any other number, just establish a breathing pattern that is comfortable and easy for you. So breathing in, expanding your belly, and this allows the air to go to the bottom of your lungs and hold and then exhale. That's right. And as you push your belly in, you're pushing any stale air in the bottom of your lungs up and out and hold for a moment and then breathe again. So just allowing yourself to get into a very comfortable rhythm of breathing. Focus on that breath. And you may or may not choose to close your eyes. And if you keep them open, I've got a series of um, slides might help you to relax even further. It's not necessary to empty your mind completely of thoughts. It's just necessary to establish at this time a very rhythmical and easy and comfortable breathing pattern for you. If you do choose to close your eyes, I'd like you to get a sense or imagine that you're in a very safe and peaceful place. And while you're in this safe and peaceful place, we don't need to visualize it just at the moment. I want you to take your attention to your feet. to your feet inside your shoes and inside your socks if you're wearing socks. And just for a moment, take your attention right down to your feet. Now clench your feet, clench your toes, draw them tightly as you can towards your heels. Really hold them, feel the tension 
in your feet and let them go and notice how it feels to let that tension go. Very good. Now I want you to take your attention to your right hand and make a fist. Clench those fingers as tightly as you can into that fist. As tight as you can and hold and hold. You might even start to feel a little of a burn. And breathing in and hold. And as you exhale, release that hand and feel what it feels like to let that tension in that hand go. Now take your attention to your left hand and do the same. Clench your hand into a fist. Hold those fingers as tight as you can. Hold and hold and hold. And keep holding and breathe in. Maybe feeling a little bit of a burn as you're holding that tension there. And as you exhale, let that hand go and feel what it feels like to release the tension. Taking your attention now back to your feet. This time both feet, clench your feet and hold. And on the exhale, relax and let it go. Taking your attention further up to your shins, your calves, your lower legs. Tense. Hold for as long as is comfortable. And on the exhale, just release. Feel what it feels like to release that tension. Now move up to your thighs and clench your thighs and your buttocks as tight as you can and hold. And on an exhale, release and let that tension go. Again, noticing what it feels like to let that tension go. Now focus on your abdomen. Pull that stomach in and hold and clench those muscles as tight as you can. And when you're ready, on an exhale, let that tension go. Taking your attention now to your chest and shoulders, front and back. And on the inhale, tense. And hold, staying tensed. And on an exhale, just let them go. Let your shoulders drop and feel easy and relaxed. Now taking attention to your head, to your neck, to your jaw, and to your scalp. On the inhale, tense, tense whatever muscles that you can feel, and hold, and on an exhale, relax. Very good. Now if your eyes are closed and you are starting to relax even more into your chair or wherever you might be that's comfortable, I wonder if you could use your imagination. And we are all born with a powerful imagination. And if you feel that you can't imagine, just create or retrieve a memory. A memory of a set of stairs 
There's just 10 of them. And you're at the top of these stairs or steps. And using your imagination, I wonder if you could imagine what they're made of. Are they wide sweeping steps like a movie set, like Gone with the Wind? Are they made of flagstones or wood or brick or concrete or metal? I don't know because it's your imagination. Just imagine a short flight of steps, just 10 in number, and they lead down to a very special place, a place that is calm and peaceful, and it's yours, only yours. It's your calm and peaceful, safe place. So in a moment, not now, I'm going to help you to count down, down through those steps. So take a deep breath in. And take the first step down. Ten. Nine, easily and effortlessly. Eight. Seven. With each step becoming more and more relaxed. Six. Five, halfway there. Anticipating what's down there. Four. Three two and on the next step just simply stepping easily effortlessly off that step into a safe and peaceful space and one and be there now and this place could be a memory it could be somewhere you've been to that you really loved and felt peaceful and safe and calm. Or it could be a number of places all put together that you've made up from your memories or simply a place that you are imagining right now. Whatever it is, this safe and peaceful place, just take some time to look around. Notice the colours, the textures, the sights, the smells, how you feel. And over in one area, you very curiously notice that there's a chair. And in that area, there seems to be some screens. some dials. It's all very curious and you being the curious type of person that you are, go over to have a look. And you notice it's some kind of control room. And you sit down and have a look at what's there. There's some old fashioned dials, you know, the round ones that move one way or another. There's one on the left and there's one on the right. And the one on the left seems to have something to do with anxiety, with anxious thoughts, with worrying things. And you realise that it's marked with zero to ten. And if you put your left hand onto it and move it, you can dial up that anxiety or you can dial it down. And you can now choose which way you want to go. And perhaps noticing that as you move the dial to the left, you're starting to feel a little less anxious, a little more calm. And out of curiosity, you go to the right-hand side. And the right-hand dial seems to move more freely to the right. And a little harder to the left. And this is dialing up feelings of peacefulness, 
a calmness, a feeling safe. And you notice the numbers on the dial and you choose how fast or slow you dial that up. And each time you dial those, that, turn that dial on the right to the right, you notice that with each breath, you're becoming more relaxed, more peaceful and calm. And as you look around, you can see screens that are tracking how you feel. You can see screens that are tracking where you look. And I wonder if, as you look around, the scene on the screen might change. The calm, beautiful light stretching off into the distance. Not quite sure what's there. As you move around this safe and peaceful place, you might notice even more. Notice what's there. Turn the colours up, make it more vibrant. You might be in a favourite place. could be a sunrise or a sunset and the sky turning lots of different colours. And as you focus on your breathing, there's a sense of wonderment, a sense of curiosity. I wonder what you will create next. The possibilities here are endless. And as you breathe in and out, your breath rhythmical, like the waves crashing to the shores. In and out. Just making a note of in your imagination of what you see, what you hear, what you feel, as you take time to explore your safe and peaceful place. You might hear water running, you might hear the waves crashing, you might hear the wind rustling the leaves, and you might even feel in your imagination a not too hot, not too cold sun, just the sunlight coming down, touching the top of your head, the shoulders giving you warmth, taking time to absorb all that you see, you hear and you feel. And in this safe and peaceful place, you find a spot just to sit and rest for a while and contemplate and taking a deep breath in and you can bring a finger to the thumb. It can be either hand and any finger to a thumb. And as you press that finger to the thumb. Press really hard as you breathe in. And as you exhale, let it go and feel the tension relaxing. Let's do it again. Breathing in and the finger to the thumb. You choose what finger. 
to which hand and pressing as you hold and as you exhale let go and say the word to yourself relax and like a muscle that's used at the gym the more that you do this the easier it becomes and the more automatic it becomes so anytime you start to feel those old feelings building up inside of you you can turn them down with the left hand turning down that dial and on the right side turning up that right hand dial with feelings of relaxation and it then following up by holding the finger to the thumb and saying the word relax. And in a moment, we're going to leave this safe and peaceful place. Just allow the calm to wash over you like waves crashing into the shore. The smell of the salt air enveloping you in calmness and peacefulness. And it's time now to start to make your way back up that staircase to that portal back into the here and now. Take a glance around this safe and peaceful place that you have created for you. And I'm going to count from one to 10. And when I reach 10, you'll be fully conscious, able to do whatever you need to do for the rest of the day or night. So one, taking that first step up. And for some people, it's quite difficult to leave this place of relaxation, of calmness, of peacefulness but you know that you can come back here at any time two three finding strength in climbing back up these stairs bringing all the wisdom and knowledge that you've gathered in this safe and peaceful place with you bringing the feelings of calmness of peacefulness of being safe four five halfway there starting to reacquaint yourself with your body sensations, just perhaps wriggling your toes as you return to full consciousness. Six, seven, feeling the energy rising up through your abdomen, through your chest, into your neck and shoulders. Eight, perhaps just giving your shoulders a little shrug. Nine, and on the next number, 10, opening your eyes, returning to full consciousness, full awareness, able to do whatever you need to do. And it is now time for you to return to full awareness. And you will be able to do whatever you need to do to continue your day in a state of relaxed consciousness. Thank you for listening. And remember that the more often you become mindful of your breathing and use the relaxation techniques used in this recording, the better you will become at managing your stress levels. If you'd like a private com um, consultation either for hypnotherapy or um, coaching please contact me my website is www.balance the number four life.com.au i look forward to hearing from you and please um, use this to manage your stress thank you